Hey, hey, this is Malika and I'm on a journey to lose 200 pounds and hopefully encouraging you to be your best self along the way. So I wanted to share four things that we need to stop doing on our weight loss journeys. And also I'm gonna share my weigh-in for this week. So the first thing is to stop comparing your weight loss to someone else's weight loss. And I know it's so easy, especially with all of us doing weight loss journeys uh, here on YouTube. It's so easy to get caught in the trap of comparison. The thing is, we don't know the other person's entire story. We don't know the factors that are going into their weight loss. They may be doing something different than we are. Their body may respond differently to things that they're eating or drinking than our bodies will. There are so many factors that can affect someone's rate of weight loss so it's really not fair to us or them to compare our rate of weight loss to theirs so the second thing is to stop making it so boring there are a lot of fun things that you can do to fit your exercise in you don't have to do exercises necessarily that you hate doing find some activities that are fun for you the other thing is find some recipes that are new to you because that way it'll change things up and you won't get so bored eating the same foods over and over again so stop making it boring and start making it fun so the third thing is to stop being so hard on yourself we know that there are going to be ups and downs in this journey and so we just have to accept that if you happen to make a mistake just take the very next best step to get yourself back on track. The scale is not always gonna be in our favor. There are gonna be times that we mess up and go outside of the boundaries that we've set for ourselves. The best thing to do is not to be hard on yourself, but just take that next best step forward so that you can get right back on track. And lastly, you need to stop waiting to start or to restart if you need to start again. Now's the time. Don't wait till next week, next Monday, or even the next day. Start right now because the sooner you start, the sooner you're going to hit your goal. So start building those healthy habits right now and don't wait. So now let's get into the weigh-in. This week, my weight was 304.6 which means I'm down one pound from last week and a total of 29 pounds. So I hope this video was helpful for you. So make sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel to follow along on my weight loss journey to lose about 200 pounds and hopefully encouraging you to be your best self along the way.